And here we are before the next matchup. Our NXT UK champion, the Mask Man, will face on Kyle O'Reilly, the friend and teammate of Mask Man Challenger, come next week Sunday pay per view event. Uh, Roddy Strong and Kyle O'Reilly, and you know Roddy, uh, Kyle O'Reilly's friend, teammate of Mask Man takeover opponent Roddy Strong. So and Kyle and Roddy are good friends. So yeah. But Mask Man is undefeated, but Kyle is Roddy by his side, so maybe this undefeated sweep gets broken, even though Mask Man got defeated via once via, uh, once um, in singles action, but it was via count out, so it doesn't really count, but it still was a loss, so yeah, but Mask Man never got pinned or submitted, so in one on one action or in tech action either, it was always Blue Falcon, his uh, yeah, ally, so to speak, or his business ally, if you will. Um, and Massman when he when both of them had beef with Imperium, and yeah. The following contest is scheduled for if I can put the low, loss down. Making his way to the ring from parts unknown. Wait, wait, what, Playing what's going in at two hundred forty-eight wow, pounds. Oh no! Kai tried to jump Massman, but he failed. But not with the neck breaker, though. Not with the damn neck breaker. But look at Kyle lifting Massman up with a suplex. As a tiles and we just Roddy looking on his friend being up Massman, but what a choke slam! Never seen a choke slam for Massman though. As Roddy now punches Massman and now destructing him. And now O'Reilly from behind with a big blow of himself and now lifting Massman up to make suplex to the to the hard ground. There's not even the mat like on the outside of the ring. There's nothing that cold floor and now the knees to the face of Massman. And that's good save us and be problem. Maybe the savior needs to be saved. And um well But the Maskman uh, at least got rid of you know, some other possibility in the last couple of weeks, but doesn't look good right now as he got uh, shipped into the steel steps. And well, nah, now Kyle O'Reilly focusing on the attack for his mate Wardy who meets Maskman on takeover. Okay, come next week, Sun as Kyle is in the ring. As now taking the official as so O'Reilly, long one take advantage, but Maskman was ready for it as a kick on strikes from O'Reilly. As Massman tried to get inside the ring, but O'Reilly is so scared of him. As Roddy tried to get him some, but the rest back to his feet and well, now calling for the bell. I think I don't know. Maybe this is a disqualification call. I don't know. I lost track of this match, and we just got started. I think, but uh, don't forget how the rivalry between Massman and Roddy uh, started. I mean, it was Massman, of course, what is a champ, is a two-time champion in the NXT UK. Um, he uh, won the title from Walter over half months ago, and uh, over half a uh, year ago, <laughs> over half months ago. Backbreaker from Massman to O'Reilly there, as um, well goes on the cover uh, early. Um, like I said, Massman won the t NXT UK Championship of the le and the legendary reign of Walter over half year ago. And what a DDT though. And uh, can I uh, talk the story or do you distract me with the great match yet again? <laughs> oh, the suplex from O'Reilly. As like I said, over half a year ago, Massman ended the legendary reign um, of uh, Walter. And not just that, um, he became champion. But the, and he also defeated, uh, he became number one, number one contender for the UK title in his first uh, pay per view debut uh, against Pete Dunne and uh, earning the shot at Walter and um, well, defeating Walter in the second ever pay per view and taking the title off him and was ending the legendary reign in an Iron Man match and defeating it against Walter in the next pay per view and the third pay per view appearance in uh, another Iron Man match. And well, um, since then, Massman had dominant title defenses all over the place, but lost the title then in the Super Sweat match where Pete Dunne um, not attacked just Massman, but also West Lee, dragged West Lee into the situation. Or Connor Wolf with great Pele there. As I wasn't done talking, Massman. Damn it. As. Um, <laughs> and, um, well. Uh, like I said, Massman retained the title but lost it then to Wesley by pinning Pete Dunne after Pete Dunne dragged him into the title picture. And, um, well, and, uh, but he regained the title that he well, lost be without being even uh, pinned or submitted for it. But he regained the title and competed at Survivor Series not once but twice. It sure was nice. I mean, much like his kick to O'Reilly. Um, 
and well um he uh he um yeah won a, so to speak against sim jr disqualified himself for unknown reason on purpose to let massman advance against the intercontinental champion king corbin and from smackdown and from raw united states champion elias and Massman walked away with the best win in the best match of Survivor Series as Massman going for a signature schoolboy super kick by the Wardy with the distraction right there well placed with action as Kyle O'Reilly might have been done for but Massman looking wisely dragging O'Reilly away from the ropes I think to go for the pin attempt but can he defeat O'Reilly one if not even two I'm surprised by that but O'Reilly is a tough man, I mean, and well experienced at taking down Massman with this arm wrench right there. As now look at this neck breaker, no, punch in the back. And um, well, I st we talked about Massman losing the title and regaining it. Um, and we spoke about uh, Survivor Series, uh, where Massman walked away with the biggest win in the, uh, on the biggest stage for him. Right, O'Reilly tossing him on his own title there. On the outside on the UK title and now attacking the official with the headlock and a punch and now Wadi is there attacking the masked man with a suplex the ref is down and out by Wadi as the ref gets his arm even attacked as Wadi attack masked man with the title belt but masked man defending him tried to defend himself but it's a knee from Wadi as the ref almost back to his feet though as a Wiley taking control of the official yet again with a combination as Wadi attacked masked man with the title belt Swag after swag, must have dislike of the audience. Wadi with a close end to the back of Massman. And they were come for the disqualification. Get ready, Saxton, you might be the replacement. Wow. It escalated here. But Massman won, but on what cause? The ref's now done for Massman stunt for I don't know how this will suit to our interim general manager of both NXT and NXT UK. And don't forget the rivalry might have been exploded after well. Wadi well, became number one contender. Um, excuse me for that. I thought I, it, my phone was muted. Um, Wadi well, became number one contender. Then um, attacked Massman when it was supposed to be a rematch between Massman and Dusty Jr. But Wadi well, had other plans to take the Ma Massman with vicious chair assault. Um, and then we had the takeover preview between Maskman and Wadi and despite D. Brian Kendrick's distraction, Mask Maskman walked away with a win after a very game Wadi swung. Well, on NXT last week, we had um, Dan Sasha was scheduled to face Wadi, but the NXT champion had other ideas, Desi Mancini had other ideas, attacked his takeover problem with Sasha. And, uh, well, if it wasn't for uh, Kyle O'Reilly, it wouldn't have backfired on the Demon yet again. But, yeah, Kyle O'Reilly got involved and stuff, but that's another story. And, well, um, also last week on NXT UK, Massman defeated D-Boy and Kendrick and if D-Boy and Kendrick would have won the matchup Well, we and Kendrick would have gone added to the match and what he distracted Massman, but Massman still walked away with the win So there's that and well, uh, yeah, here we have the, yeah Wow What a heated shit, but it is what it is this, The match Result in the end of the disqualification, and I I don't know how our general manager will react to that, but it is what it is, and well, let's see how this will uh, turn out next week on NXT UK, the final NXT UK before our takeover UK pay per view, which we have NXT and NXT UK will combine, and after that the could go all got separated and the draft will happen and stuff but we are far from being over guys we have still two main events left to come